Wi-Fi has been the de facto connectivity technology in the enterprise for some time now, but it's been known for a few pros and cons. Mission critical apps in the enterprise today demand another lane of wireless communication that's capable of delivering service level agreements around latency, jitter, throughput, and capable of offering some infrastructure controlled mobility. CBRS based private LTE provides a clear solution to these challenges with simplified network infrastructure deployment enabled by Solona and device connectivity by Cradlepoint. In this demo, we will demonstrate how private LTE networks can deliver application-aware end-to-end quality service from CradlePoint at the network edge to the Solana mobile core. Prioritizing and isolating mission-critical low-latency applications over wireless has been a real challenge. That is until now. Close integration between CradlePoint and Solana enables the ability to run multiple mission-critical applications on the same private LTE network. And this includes everything from computer vision to Industry 4.0 to enterprise-owned mobile devices. The demo kit we're using today includes a Cradlepoint AER2200 Edge router, which has native support for CBRS. The AER2200 can operate in licensed, shared, or unlicensed spectrum, offering network connectivity options for end user and IoT devices. In this demo, it will be offering connectivity for a 4K IP camera over PoE. In order to simulate the best effort data flows next to this high-priority traffic, we've set up iPerf servers in each network segment. The router cellular antennas are placed here inside our RF cage, where you'll also see the Solona radio. This radio is directly connected to the LAN and automatically discovers and communicates with the Solona edge. That's where the cellular wireless traffic will terminate and integrate with the existing local area network. Solona edge can be deployed anywhere from the enterprise edge to a private data center or public cloud, depending on a client's network architecture. Also within the LAN is a laptop which we're using to display the live stream received from the IP camera. Application aware QoS mapping occurs dynamically from the cradle point endpoint to the Solona edge, ensuring video traffic always has the highest level of priority. Our live demo shows two video streams, the upper right stream delivered by Solona and cradle point QoS, with the stream below delivered via best effort. Both streams are running full HD, 1080p, 30 frames per second. On the left side, you'll see real-time network flow analysis provided by Intop. So what happens when we introduce competing network traffic? The unprotected video is experiencing degradation. The blue buffer bar is fluctuating, frames are being dropped, and we're seeing the video stutter and freeze. Meanwhile, the protected video stream is completely stable, regardless of other network activity. In conclusion, with more business critical services requiring low latency, high performance, and privacy, CBRS-based LTE networks have emerged as a viable connectivity and mobility option across enterprise verticals. This end-to-end -end quality of service framework applies to private LTE networks today and will extend to 5G networks of tomorrow. The joint solution we've demonstrated here finally gives operators, service providers, channel resellers, and enterprise IT teams the ability to deliver guaranteed service levels over wireless and meet the demanding application requirements of tomorrow's enterprises. Mm -hmm.